Hello everybody and uh, welcome to part 2 of my ADA on Slackware series. In part 1 we installed the Knapp GPL 2011 ADA compiler on the system and here in part 2 we're going to be installing the Florist GPL 2011 POSIX library. Now the first thing we're going to do is switch to the unprivileged user Thomas. Here we go. And then we're going to check if he's also got the Knapp make GPL 2011 compiler and lo and behold he does. I've already downloaded the Flores package from the libra.adacore.com website. See it's here, it's plain tabo. And the other packages we'll be installing in, in part uh, 3, 4 and 5 already here also AWS can't call it for it yet. But let's focus on Flores. Unpack it. There we go. See this new directory change into that one and here we have all the source files first step is plain configure I'm going to check out all the options with the hook feature here going on in, uh, in the Flores configure script so the only thing we're going to be doing is setting the prefix we want it installed in USR Knet. so let's do that one for a little while. That's it. And then we do the compile step. The J option here is just to, it, it sets the amount of cores that you want to use for the compiler. In my case, I have fours available on this system, so I, I use four cores. That's it, and then we install it. Now see, it's available here. That's Flores lib. So in order to use Florist now in your own ADA programs, all you have to do is with Florist in your GPR project file. And that's basically it. Hope to see you in part three, where we'll be installing the XML ADA GPL 4.1 uh, XML library. Thank you.